Hello, Scorpio, and welcome now to Tuesday. Well, sunny and light casting for a second day in a row. This is a nesting and resting period. Overall, the moon is focusing emotion on your survival, which can come down to a lot of topics, frankly. You in your family, you in your relationship to yourself, how many times you brush your teeth a day. Survival is a big umbrella under which a lot of biology lives, correct? Most of the time, people nest and rest. But in the next 24 hours, your emotions in particular, I want you to pay attention to how you feel because the moon is crossing over Neptune. And what that means is, is that you're going to be emotionally very intuitive. Now, everyone on the planet will be this way. Neptune kind of hardwires us to source. When the moon crosses in front of it, our emotions get a bit of a taste of source. So what is your source telling you? And I think this is a bit of an emotional setup for tomorrow's transit when the moon moves into Pisces and moves against or opposite Saturn. Now that will create, I think, a bit of a fault line between you in the world and what your personal dreams are. And that is where the learning will be in the next two days, frankly, Scorpio. You see, Saturn is in your sector of consciousness regarding society. Scorpios really don't know how well to integrate into society. In fact, every Scorpio I know would rather say move when someone's in front of them than excuse me. And I'm not trying to be judgmental, but Scorpios really do have that attitude that society should move. Now that's cool and all, especially when you have a stinger, but you probably won't get as many effects or support as you want. So Saturn is up there, especially since January, asking Scorpios to rethink. Who am I in the world? What does the world think I am? What do I want to be known for or known as in the world? What's the title on my business card? Who are my friends? Do they really support me? Those are all Saturn retrograde questions. And now with the Saturn op opposing the moon in the house of dreams, I'm expecting for the next two days, for you to be processing that emotionally. Well, I want to be this when I grow up. Well, society says I can't. Well, does society say you can't? All those sorts of questions. So it's going to be very deep and very pensive with potential breakthrough tomorrow. We'll talk more about that. Just know this. You don't have to answer all these questions right now. But on May 3rd, Saturn goes direct, which means the universe will be asking you for how you see yourself in the world. So you might as well process it now while you can. All right, Scorpio. That's all I have for Tuesday. I'll see you tomorrow with more. Live, love, be.